All right, here we are. Let's go through the door. Um, from what I know, there's going to be a lot of cutscenes. So. Just working on a pet project of mine. Though she's not above biting the hand that feeds her. Was hoping we might try and solve the mystery of poor Clive Rossfield, a bearer of the San Brequa Imperial Army sent behind enemy lines, with orders to wait until it turned into a brawl, then slit the Dominant's throat in the chaos. I didn't know it was her. How could it be? And so, to save her neck, you slit your sergeants, then set your sights on the hills. Conveniently forgetting how the Empire deals with deserters. Because with that on your chop, my friend, we both know you won't be getting far. You've fallen a long way, Lord Rossfield. Have it said that I'm a poor host? What do you mean to do with her? Do with her? Why nothing? Her life is her own now. If I wanted to use her, do you think I'd be talking to you? All I want to do is help. Dominance like her, branded like you. Of course, the realm doesn't approve, which is why we live in a cave. <laughs> yeah, yeah, pretty much. And it's also why we need help. And Brandy do know one end of a sword from the other. What say you, Clive? Will you join us? Sid, was it? I trust that you'll do right by Jill. Until my brother is avenged, I must walk my own path. Avenged? My brother was murdered by a second dominant of fire. Phoenix is evil twin. Oh, bugger me. Another rumor proven true. I only stand here today because of Joshua. Thirteen years I've waited for this chance. I've slept in filth, drunk from a gutter, killed more men than I can count. You're right. The Empire will not suffer a deserter. This will be my best opportunity. My last. Which is why you should join us. I told you I'm not interested, I know. <clears throat> One of my scouts sent word there's a group of branded fugitives north of here, in the Imperial village of Lost Wing. Among them is one he believes to be a dominant of fire. Is he certain? What say we go and ask him? <laughs> yeah, let's go ask him. <laughs> oh, this is gonna be... This doesn't mean I'm joining you. Mate, ready then. You'll find everything you need down in the main hall, as well as a few things you don't. Have fun. Whoa, this is gonna be great. <gasps> is it? Goots, was it? Perhaps you can help. Sid asked me to make ready for our mission. How does one go about that here? Uh, well, uh, there's old Nan's place. Uh, oh, uh, on 
on second thoughts, uh, you maybe want to see Blackthorn first. <laughs> oh, scared of none. To the forge it is then. I mean, I'd be afraid of her too. Oh, wait, no, hold up. You'll be needing this. Blackthorn won't take no notice of you otherwise. I feel like he's on the spectrum. So. There's nothing wrong with that. I need to clarify that before somebody takes it out of context, even though somebody is going to, anyways. I'll be accompanying Sita Lostwing, and I need you to see to my equipment. You could be accompanying the goddess Grieger to our holy bedchamber for all I care. I'm not lifting a finger for you. Is that so? Do you want that or not? I can take it back. <sighs> Damn you, Goots. <laughs> all right, all right. No need to be hasty. Let's have a look at you. I doubt that lock has stay a Moogle's fart. Bloody Imperials. They'd rather see their bearers dead than kid it out properly. Ah, <sighs> oh, Jan, As a favor to Goot's mine. And the bell. Caesar's Ah, oh, okay. You want anything else? Bring your own materials. I'll bear that in mind. Sound okay. Yeah, bring my own material. That's that's pretty much how it always goes. A uh, word of advice. Don't let Sid decide what's best for you. Yeah, that's I mean, hey. Okay. <clears throat> so notice toll, new forge recipes, blah blah blah. I suppose I should think good. The gift worked. You have my thanks. I, uh, <laughs> Come on, nearly there. Oh. One of them looks familiar. If it's the same guy from the past. Oh, you blankets, quick as you like. Wait, yeah, it might be him. Right, we make it comfortable while the bed's made up. Well, you're just gonna stand there. Someone fetch some water. I'll get the bucket. Yeah, you go and see if Otto needs out, eh? Yeah. Wait, me? But we we all have to do our fair share, Clive. <laughs> oh. What the hell have I got myself into? <sighs> Who are they? Imperial bearers. Who the hell are you? Who the hell are you? Shit, at this rate, you won't make it through the night. Think you can find your way up them stairs to the infirmary? We need Tyre. Well, go on. Shift your ass. <laughs> I mean, hey. The one looking after yeah, you. Everyone's gotta. Like I said, everyone's gotta pull their own weight. Oh, the door I but Okay, so it's the infirmary. Okay, nice, nice. Your friend needs her rest. There'll be time for tearful reunions when she's recovered. I'm not here for Jill. You're wanted downstairs. There are injured bearers in need of attention. Well, why didn't you say so? <sighs> I did say so. <laughs> oh, okay. So, and as I said in the um, uh, in the demo, I'm going to try and keep the episodes between 20 to 30 minutes long. Try. 
cutscene dependent or fight dependent because I'm going into this hella blind so I don't know what's gonna happen the uh, only thing I know is things that I've seen from what was shown off and that was very little another fine day at the hideaway too many of the bearers who come here arrive in this state it's no easy thing casting off your chains by the time most pluck up the courage they're already too far gone these two here are the lucky ones. The name's Otto. You need anything? You ask me. Well, Otto, I do need some supplies. Do you now? Then Lady Karen over there will be more than happy to help you. <laughs> right. <laughs> right. Oh. And thanks. Be seeing you. Not likely. I won't be staying. Is that right? Well, for as long as you are here, consider yourself welcome. You helped us today, and we won't forget it. <laughs> Did you, do you see that? Side quests unlocked. Ooh, boy. I'm definitely going to do side quests uh, for the playthrough. Supplies for my journey to Lost Wing. Otto said you could provide them. What's that? Does the newcomer think it proper to make demands of a poor old matron before even introducing himself? <sighs> it's Clive. Well, Clive, I hear that dog is yours. Since he followed Sid home one night, I've seen to it that his chin's rubbed and his belly fed. Though I suppose that's your job now. Unless you lose him again. I won't. Not also, again. like, I, I was pointing out, like, the Thank sword sits him. on the, so, the little scabbard. See? It sits nice on the scabbard, not in what? the scabbard. That's... I knew it didn't sit in the scabbard when I looked at it. I didn't think it would just sit on the scabbard. Life doesn't work that way. <sighs> Although I think that's... Uh, fuck, what's the name of a short one? I don't remember. Okay. Oh, uh, okay. Oh, 500? I don't have 500! Okay, so I don't even think I can, uh... Oh! Purchase new gear, materials, or consumables. I'm full, full, full. Iron brace. Oh! Better all be here. Equip. Okay. And yeah, I don't even. That's that's weaker than what I got. So. That's all. Why you barely a guilty your name? Well, I am a branded. <gasps> Dargo. And after all I've done for you. <laughs> all right. All right. I can make an exception. But just this once, mind. My stores are getting cluttered and I need to make room for the next shipment. Thank you. Thank me? Thank your dog. <laughs> oh, Torgo! I love the big puppy. Take the stuff. Boop. Whoa. Ah, bright. Bright. Oh. Hall of Virtue. Lunch training. No, I don't want to train. I guess I have to train. All right. <sighs> Menu. Okay. 
can I? Okay. Okay, can I leave now? Training options. Menu. How do I... <clears throat> Alright, I'm gonna finish this whatever it wants me to do, and then I'll return. Alright, ended the training. Now, can I leave? You all done? Hmm. Oh, two potions. You all miss the most, Lady Karen. It always is. Don't stop you going, does it? This should be fun. Right. <laughs> Ooh, we're gonna get some action this episode. <gasps> Dargoy! I love my big boy. Or girl. I don't remember what the gender is for Torkoal. <clears throat> Use the world map to instantly travel. Some way markers. Do do do. Spies. Make for great wood. Local map. Uh. There's a good girl. It's a chocobo. Open the world map. And where are we going? Over there. Okay, cool. Onward! Hmm. Oh, this is the forest they showed off. We should have taken the crystal road. And I told you that we're outlaws. And you want every bounty hunter in Storm hurrying us from here to the Holy Capital. Besides, what's wrong with a shortcut through nature's splendor? <laughs> and a place like this still exists is a miracle in itself. Blood flies and all. We'll be back in Imperial land soon. Are you alright? Never better. Sounds like it. Alright, let's go. <gasps> <laughs> that there is a fine hound. Soon took to hunting. Fearless as you like. It's good to have you back, Togo. Now, we don't want to be caught in the forest after nightfall. I suppose not. Yeah, probably not. Fanning Empress. Join the party. <clears throat> oh, okay. Did I mention there'd be deadly beasts? There'll be deadly beasts. <laughs> Nothing a trained assassin can't handle, though. How reassuring. You're welcome for that and the shortcut. Uh, all right, let's go. <gasps> I need to remember how to run. One second. Never mind. I don't think I have a run button. This is as fast as he goes. Maybe they're friendly, like Togo. Oh, maybe they're not. And boom! Oh, I missed. I missed. New enemy approach. Oh. And 
under. Oh, we're about to be attacked, aren't we? Either they're running to something or from some. From something! Looking what? for food. No more walls where he's from. The north was one of the first parts of storm to fall to the blight. Poor oh, sod. I'd invite him over for a cup of tea if I didn't think he'd eat the dog. Something's wrong. Try and stay out of its path. Yeah, we probably should. Remember when I said there were deadly beasts? Well, the shrubs of these parts are much better. Any way you to mention this hell. Ow. I'll be taking that. And there's nothing else over here. Alright, cool. Pretty much every time I get hit, it's gonna be my fault because after <laughs> you. Thank you kindly. Uh, oh, Sid. The ruins. Whoa. Some say there was a time they blocked out the stars. Down was the only way left for them to go. There's probably a lesson to be learned from that. But it can wait. Come on. Yo, mind your head. That is beautiful. Alright, well, while we look off into the distance, I'm going to end this episode here. Like, comment, subscribe if you so choose to. And I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye!